Well, the old St. Pete Pier, a bit of an eyesore right now. So what comes next? This is new video of the demolition still underway. City staffers say the inverted pyramid, that should be down in two to three weeks, and the entire structure should be gone by January or wow. February, making way for construction to start on the new pier at the beginning of 2017. So I think we all want to know mm -hmm. what will this new pier look like when it's all said and done. 10 News reporter Jenny Dean walks you through some of the exciting features of the pier park just unveiled today. Let's start with the Welcome Plaza. It's right at the beginning of the pier before you go out over the water. Some cool features of this, there's actually a beach area way out over here. And this, this is a water play area with jets coming out of the ground that can be turned off if they have an event here. And then there's, of course, the tilted lawn area that you can see where parents can sit there and relax and watch their kids. And just beyond all of this is an education center. You could talk to school groups there. It could be a place for rotating um, exhibitions. Let's head further out onto the pier now to the event plaza. There's going to be a large area with a lawn bowl. This could accommodate any outdoor concerts. And there's an overlook platform. It's pretty cool. It features step seating with a flat area at the bottom, and that could actually be used for private events like weddings. Just behind it, that white part you see there, that is going to be the restaurant, and it's going to have glass on three sides. But it doesn't end there. At the very end of the pier, there's one of the most interesting features, the water lounge. I think to be able to go down, take off your shoes as a casual visitor, roll up your pants, put your feet in the water, you know, have a snack, have a drink. Overall, it's an ambitious design that will allow it to stand the test of time. By building in versatility and scalability, it means that we can... To Thing that feels right now, but it has the ability to, to, to um, change over time. And, and with each new generation, they can make it their own. If all stays on schedule, the new pier will open in fall of 2018. 